Are you ready for food? That's it, that's a yes. So. Hello and welcome back to Norman Most Mustard and today you join me for another video about my new miniature dash and puppy which is 13 weeks today and he's called Lenny. So what am I going to talk about today? Well, there's actually some things we bought for our dog and one of them is a slow feeder dog bowl. Now, you may not have heard of one of these before, but essentially they are a bowl designed to slow down the, the feeding of your dog essentially. When we first got Lenny, we found that whenever we put any sort of food in his bowl, it was gone within 20 seconds and it led to him having huge bloat around his, his little belly essentially. Um, doing a bit of research online, this sort of bloat isn't good for dogs. Um, they also can choke from eating too quickly. They can also vomit from eating too quickly. And generally, they're still hungry after they've eaten. So we decided to get something called a slow feeder bowl, uh, bowl which we'll get, we'll get to in a minute. So let's first weigh out Lenny's food. Let's just get that set up there. And you'll see how much I feed him. It, which isn't a lot, actually, to be honest. We try, try to keep it quite try to keep it quite light really because he's a small dog so we'd weigh it out on this oh so you can hear him already it's uh, the food this is the food we use it's called AVA and it is it's anti hyperallergenic And it's also grain free. There it is for small breeds. I don't know if you can see it there. It's really good food anyway. Lenny really likes it. Let's go and give this to this little rascal here. Sit down. Good boy. Are you ready for food? That's it, that's a yes. So let's go. Come on. So this is a bowl, as you can see. Hey! Sit, 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 good boy. So that's the bowl. When you put the food in, sit, sit, ah, ah, sit. As you can see, he's going absolutely crazy for it, but the food drops down in amongst all the little nodules there, you see, and it's, he's struggling to get it, and it means he has to work harder to get it. Now, what this does is, it stops him from eating it so quickly, it stops the bloating because he's not gulping in there. It slows it all the way down, obviously doesn't doesn't get too too much food too quickly. As you can see, he works really hard for it. The odd one drops out. And he really likes it and it really does slow him down. And it means he's less hungry. So he's just getting to the final ones now. And you'll see he just spins himself around, <laughs> trying to get at them. But normally by now it's been two minutes and he would have finished by now. And you can see he's working really, really hard to get them. So as I mentioned, the main benefits to, to this feeding bowl over just a standard bowl is obviously slower so he doesn't get hungry. Um, so he, his appetite isn't so bad and he feels fuller. Number two, it stops vomiting, obviously because he's eating slower. It stops bloating, which can be really bad for your dog's health. And also, it just means is, um, well, I think it's a nice way for them to be engaging with the food rather than just scoffing it down. Obviously, there are some negatives to this bowl, or can be negatives. If you do get a metal one, for example, or even a plastic one, the plastic one, you could end up eating some of these little nodules or if he's on a metal one, I suppose he could chip his teeth on there. But of course, whenever there's anything like this, there's always going to be positives and negatives. But as you can see, he's not bloated at all. He's got a nice full belly and he is happy to go, hey, was that nice? Hey, sit, sit. Good boy, he's a good boy. So yeah, he's really happy now. So, that's it for today. Um, I will be doing some more videos. The next video I will do on this little piece of equipment here, the ramp and how we use the ramp and how 
It is a really good piece of equipment, especially if you've got a dash und, um, because obviously they're back issues that they have. Um, but yeah, do join me. Let me know if you've got a slow feeder dog bowl and if it's helped and if you've thought about buying one. Uh, if you've got one now, do let me know how you get on with it. And please like, comment, subscribe. And also my Instagram is there on the screen now. Okay, thank you very much and I'll see you soon. Bye.